everyone, happy Plantive Tuesday. This is Megan, the owner of the Zen Succulent, and I'm here to tell you about the lovely staghorn fern. There's many different ways that you can plant this plant, not only have it in potted, but also mounted. So I'm glad to tell you more. Staghorn ferns get this unworldly look because of their floppy leaves that go all over the place. They get their name also because their leaves look like stag for many varieties. And there's over 17 different varieties of staghorns, all noticed by their leaf texture. The requirement is very simple for your staghorn. For lighting, it likes low to medium light, so it can go in a place that doesn't get as much natural or fluorescent light. Also, when it comes to watering, make sure to saturate your staghorn because it loves moisture. And humidity and good care for staghorns requires frequent watering so make sure that your plant stays moist but allow it to dry out in between watering some problem with stags are over watering the leaves will just pull out from their sockets so we want to make sure that they dry out in between this right here is a saddle for your staghorn fern and it's green right now but it'll eventually will turn brown and papery with age this helps protect the specimen um, growing up in trees and sorts like that to keep it fully in Intact. Two popular ways to house your staghorns. One can be that potted variety, just having it in a simple pot planted, and the other is mounted. Staghorns tend to get large and their leaf structure need a lot of space. Eventually, mounting is a great option for them, and here's one that we've mounted in the storefront. I have a great link on how to mount them, and you're going to be able to swipe up to see that at the end of the video. Thanks for following along for our Plan Tip Tuesdays here at the Zen Succulent. We're open Wednesdays through Sundays and always online. Looking forward to a great holiday season here at the storefront. And thank you all so much for tuning in.